Cozy day on the Mewawi coast and everything is fine except, well, no, not everything is fine. Um, well, France imploded, Italy is no more. Uh, 1641 was a disaster. Uh, Inca is dead. The Pope had to relocate. Zoom out a bit. A yeah, bit I'm pretty sure. Um, no, we're just trolling. Actually. Yeah, there, right. All right. Nothing so, changed. There, there was a big war that started in uh, 1641. Because, as you can see, the world has decided that there were, you have to pick a side, yeah. and the divide line is clearly there in the middle of the like uh, Persia and uh, Europe and uh, and Asia. Uh, there is a clear divide line and most people have picked a side except once again the Americans would just uh, stand by and uh, and watch things unfold from uh, the relative safety of their islands. But, but to be honest guys we didn't have to post anything on social media because not much has been going on. It's a very very slow war with loads of attrition with loads of casualties that's for sure. That's the only major thing that happened yeah. aside from a few provinces that were taken is the casualties. Yeah. Can you pop them up yeah, so we can sure, show the sure. numbers? It, it all started when uh, when Mewar decided to uh, reconquer the core in, uh, in Bella. So for this five development, the fish province in the middle of the desert, so far uh, 3 million people have died on the defending side and 1.78 million have died on the attacking side. So we're basically close to almost like uh, 5 million dead for this great piece of land that I'm sure Mewa cannot wait to get. And since they oh, don't <laughs> own that great piece of, uh, of, of, of desert, well, they're actually losing the war, uh, even if the, the score is on their side. And so, uh, a lot of people have come over, like Italy walked all over there. Uh, can we switch to the political map mode so we can see like occupied terrain and all? And uh, just, um, yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, as you can see, uh, Mewar is uh, so far being pushed back, even if they have made the, uh, the defender pay very, very, very uh, dearly. Uh, they, they still have the numbers for them, uh, well, I mean, not on the front, but they could bring the numbers if uh, they were willing to commit them. But the question is, will they do? Because Mewar uh, has his army stuck there, uh, the Mughals are waiting up there in the, in the Delhi region. Um, uh, a huge contingent of uh, the Xing is actually defending the, the border against another incursion from the German states. Uh, we have we have the Palatinates, we have Roma, we have the Prussia, we have Saxony, Persia, Aragon. Yeah, the big news is that both Persia, Rutania, and Rum has this time decided to join the uh, the European side and, and not the uh, yeah, Middle East actually. or the they European did. side. And so we have a first incursion. We have an incursion north from the steppes, uh, and, and and the huge Blondie. then the battles are going on there. Oh god, this is this is not going well for me. Where we clearly have doesn't have the numbers there. East versus west. They don't have the numbers. They don't have the. They, they have the land, but that Ooh. that's not going to be enough. They have the discipline. They they, they don't have the. They, they have equivalent morale almost, but the numbers aren't there. Uh, the terrain no, is, is on the side. This no, is a done deal. No, no, they, and, no. and oh, and the leader just died. Uh, oh, oh, but 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 the, oh, there is a train of people coming from up north. Like the reinforcements are pouring in from Delhi, and will we be able to hold I'm up not again? Sure I'm not sure. Can they, can they hold mm -hmm. up? Can they hold up? Do we even have someone willing to fight? Like there is only like those five dudes on the front line holding against the horde in front of them. Like 300 k Italians and Persians and maybe oh, and no, that's done. That's well. Done. Uh, We're and, pulling and up yeah, a poll yeah, to yeah, yeah. have Moogles, you guys choose Moogles between Moogles East and West. West. Just in West. Yeah. And sure, East uh, clearly doesn't have the numbers. So I guess the, the troop will have to clearly regroup themselves, pace themselves, and and pick the battle closely. The problem is that they are divided. They are divided because they are yeah, seeing the number. As the number, but uh, but they're they're tied up up north where uh, where, where all the Germans uh, run and and the others are making a push through the steps. It's 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 slow land. It's huge land. It's desert. It's 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 a trek through the desert that they're gonna pay. It. They're gonna pay it in attrition. We only have like 700k dead. I think that number is gonna continue growing. Oh, for sure. The question is, where are the others? Orisa is supposed to be on this. So far, they are content with killing their old rebels. 
Uh, Khmer is supposed to be on this, they're doing the same. Japan is supposed to be a great ally, but where is Japan? Where, where the hell are you, Japan? What, what are you doing? What, what is the Bushido in there? Where are you? One of, uh, 40, half of your army is just sitting there, like watching, uh, what, watching the, I don't know, like the cherry blossoms but the or some stuff. the Navy is moving. The Navy is moving. Yeah, they have 20. Oh, yes, they decided to, uh, to strike back and invade Corsica alone. Oh, that's gonna just make a huge tent. I'm pretty sure Italy is thinking about surrendering right now, but to this like, I don't know, what is that, like 30k? No, yeah. 40k, yeah, I mean, it's sure, this is like some kind of, oh, but no, the Italians are, 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 are seeing that, yes. They have 45k on the mainland waiting, waiting for them. There. Yeah, Ray, God, I mean, Japan has, uh, has some projective force, right, because they uh, they have this small uh, small island of Malta. I don't think I don't think those, those 40k are, are going to be enough no, to, to open no, a no, serious no, front. Like, is, is Spain even in this war? Oh yeah, Spain mm. is in the war. Spain is in the war, and they're just like sitting there in the middle of like I don't know, like it's it's November, I guess. It's, I think it's cold. We prefer to stay there. I don't know. No, don't go trek all the way to to die for for some days. Oh, and we have another battle going there. What what's what's happening there? Like who, who is winning? Oh, oh, clearly this time, this time, no, no, again, may war. You don't have the numbers, but 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 Orisa is actually coming. Orisa is coming. Not no, make no, it in no, time. no. They're pulling back. Don't pull back. Help your friends. You you could you I mean you may oh oh they're trying to stop the reinforcement that's not that's not that bad actually that that that's a good idea and and they are, they are making a dent they have the discipline on their side uh, even if the Mughals have the moral and, and the terrain uh, they have they have the general he has oh yeah he has an amazing like six shock four fire against three and four they have the advantage on all the rolls. And, yeah, and the Mughals much. are coming, the Mughals are coming, and, and, and the other one up there are just holding the reinforcements so that, yeah, and, and they, they got it, they, they push them back, oh, oh that, that's some good planning, that, that's how you win this battle. You just, you don't pile just more and more units on the same spot, like that, 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 that's just throwing bodies at the problem. Just, just, just block, try to yeah. avoid the reinforcement. Yeah, yeah, block the reinforcement, sure. pick them apart, yeah, that's, no, that's how move. you win, yeah, they got them. They and got them, go. they send them back. They send them back, but that, that's not going to be enough. Can we have a status on the Great Powers list, just to be sure? Sure, sure, there we go. So Orisa is still the first one still with uh, an almost 200 Ks. Uh, uh, the Mughals are close sec or second. Uh, France is, uh, is starting to be a bit slow behind the Mughals, but that, that's still totally doable. Switzerland uh, died, yes, it did. When well, did no, it Switzerland started? didn't die. Switzerland was alive? exiled. And, oh, yeah, and, no, you And their exiled colonies are now actually in, a, in, in an interesting turn of events, where they are there. They are a vassal of Australia now. Nice. So, so yes. Yeah, so when did that happen? Uh, well, I guess while everybody was busy throwing bodies in the desert, uh, so I think everybody is like looking at each other. They need to make a push up north. Up north, but maybe the Germans have been getting some progress. I mean, they, let's check. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, they have been. They, they have. But, but then again, this is steps. This is this is this is steps and desert. The Mughal are not gonna stand there to defend that. This is terrible for maneuver. They have they have forts though. There are forts that have fallen to the to the French and uh, and oh oh, did they make peace? They did. did they did it. Oh, over. and I think they transferred two provinces there. Like I'm pretty sure those two provinces were not Persian in the past, and maybe this one too. Yeah, that that's and that, it's that's done. It. That's done. That that's a done deal, and that. All this for a piece of desert. Yeah, this is like, oh, well, I mean, no, because on the other side, they, they managed to get like two, well, yeah, that's not great, but that's clearly better than what the other side wanted. Yeah. So, yeah, we, we can pay or some respect to the six million dead who, who for died. For two provinces. For, for, and the war to come, because obviously they took two provinces, which are all part of one state, each other. So someone is going to want to come back and say, do so state or not complete, this is not acceptable. I, and some ruler in like the next 10 or 15 years is gonna get up on some throne and say, nope, nope, oh, this yeah. is not acceptable. My states are so ugly on the picture. I need to do something about it. And 10 more uh, millions are gonna die for that. All right, let's go a bit towards Europe. Uh, yeah. Oh, we got Mewar on stream. <laughs> we counted the dead. Uh, and the last time I checked, it was about 6 million. And we got, what, 23 developments, changed hand about. So that's like... 
a lot of people for one point of development. They also had to give up their colonial holdings. That was a part of a deal that prevented America from coming in and potentially making it a two-front war. America, so. but America is not independent right now, or is it? Uh, well, the, to, to keep Inca and to keep Mexico from attacking. Oh, right. Oh, right. But uh, do they have the force to project that, or is that just like the bluff? Well, I, you didn't I'm, want to take chances. They didn't. It wasn't us. They. It was America that thought, well, what are we going to get from winning? So what was the rationale behind that war? What happened exactly? Well, the rationale was that uh, uh, there's no reason for a generation of Europeans to die in India, but uh, apparently mm. we didn't have the same calculus they did. France has no manpower right now, so like yeah. that, that tells you something about what, like how costly it was. Yeah, yeah it was a, it was yeah. a very costly. <laughs> Do you see like anyone trying to jump on their allies now because they, 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 they bled dry more than the other? For example, uh, Russia didn't take any casualties in the war. They still have, they have like 200,000 cane bank. Yeah, uh, one, one, one thing you guys probably don't know mm. is that the Qing had an agreement. They, they'd signed an agreement with Persia saying that they wouldn't engage with Persian troops. And so Persia cleverly uh, had a few troops uh, stashed with the Prussian armies when they were sieging in the north. Uh, preventing oh, right. Qing engagement, so like... Yeah, so be careful what you sign. Yeah, no, I mean, the, the, it was clever, it was clever, for sure. The war is... Oh, yes! Oh, yes. Uh, your prediction oh, nice. was right, and you didn't have even the time very, to wait. Nice. What happened? Right. Russia... Ah, uh, I, was, I was just calling it. But, but yeah, Russia said, like, you know what? I didn't take that many losses from the war. So now it's my time to go. They decided so to no provinces taken, no nothing. So, I mean, as two Prussians, they say like, whatever is supposed to be Poland right now must be ours. So yeah. we're just going east again. Yeah. Uh, let's see, let's see who is against who. So, okay, so right now it's just like the German states and Norway against basically uh, Slavs, uh, Rutania, Prussia, even in uh, Novgorod. So, yeah, the conflict so far is huge, but did not escalate Ooh, Ooh, and yet. Rome didn't take part. Oh, my bad. They are. Yeah, yeah, Rome is in there. So let's jump in. Let's see, let's see. Is there so far no battles? Uh, All the Prussian army is uh, currently uh, dying of dysentery somewhere, sieging a province. Uh, Ooh, there's just a small Polish army Why are they going pulling by? away? Why are you pulling away your Prussia? You Prussia, you're standing in the defensive pot. Why are you pulling away? This is not how you play Prussia. This is this is not how Prussia works. Well, to be fair, or, or maybe they have spies they, they, and seen yeah. them. No, they don't have spies. We don't see this. They, they don't know. Like you, they might have spies within the I mean, castle, yeah, just ma checking the screens of the other spies. Yeah, of the other yeah maybe, you don't know that. Maybe, maybe. Like, like okay, yes, there are some numbers waiting for you on the other side. You don't know that. We someone know is that, saying that but something still. is going on in Asia. Hmm. Actually, something weird. Um, oh wait, the Mamluks were not in the war. What happened? Did the Mamluks join? Did they pick a side? They did. Yes, the Mamluks pick a side. They they join in. Uh, we might see things escalate now because oh Ooh, wow no that's the colonies oh, of yeah, Norway that's, no, that's, that's the Norway. colonies of that's Norway fine. but we're probably gonna sit there. The question is uh, if uh, if Russia thinks they just like went out of their head like, in there, they might try to pull Italy and uh, and and France in that, which are technically their ally. And and since they bled for that stupid conflict just before, oh it's it's yeah. interesting though because like. Persia just bled for so that Persia could take that provinces and, and Saxony and no Persia is on the other side like like that Back that's the Prussia. way that you just side with their enemies the next battle that's how you do it oh all right so how are they going to do something for about now, it no it's, it's they're not moving it's that like, much i think it's, it's, Prussia, it's like it's like Prussia it's, is a bit scared of doing something yeah i mean those positions are okay but they wouldn't be worse off here yes the oath has been broken which oath which oath Prussia Prussia had an oath, let me check. Poland will cede provinces in the Mazovia and central Poland. Prussia seizes all hostility and vice versa. Okay, so that was what was promised and not what was delivered, right? Yes, they just attacked. All right, I guess it's time to fetch a monk. But was the first part, like, did you provide the provinces yes. they asked? Yes. Okay, so so I guess they got really, like, mm, they, they got that taste of, uh, of Polish land and they said, like, oh, we want more. Like, like, like Kirsten Dunst in the interview with the vampire, you know, like, oh, I don't know if you see that scene, but he's like, yes, oh, yes, I, I, want I want more, I want more. They tasted blood, they tasted blood and they want more, but, but, but they're not getting it. 
We're not getting it. The blood is just right there. It's in the red. But we're not taking it. We're just like sitting there. What are we waiting for? Like, is there a secret maneuver from Norway to take Novgorod? Like, nobody's moving. Nobody's moving. Everyone's sitting. It's, it's like World War II all over again. You attack the enemy and then you stand on your fault. Like, yeah, this is totally going to work. Like, you're the Germans. You should not doing, be doing this. French should be doing this. They would be stupid, but they would be doing this. You should not be doing this. You should be on the attack. Where is the Prussian charge? Damn it. It's not there. Okay. Sorry. And the, the allies... The, the, oh, wait, wait. Rome is actually moving. Moving its way towards the north? Yeah, Saxony said, well, pff, we're not going to help Russia. But the others are like, oh, yeah. Oh, oh, it, what did Italy do? Oh, classic Italy. You backstab your allies. Of course. <laughs> Lorenzo would be proud. What is happening there? Did they, did they no, join the other a side? Please. Did they join the other side? Tell me they joined the other side, like true Italians in World War One and World War Two. Yes, they did. Great Italians. They just backstabbed their allies and went on the other side. So now we know who's gonna win. Italians have picked the side, oh, well. and history is right. Italy's always on the winning side. The old switcheroo, definitely. Exactly. Oh my God, this is possibly the end of the Germans. It's like they went, they went east. They went east. It, it, we're just waiting for France. Like, what is France doing? Oh, Russia is calling in France. Nothing like, oops. Let's oops. see what France does. Things, I'm curious. Things are getting very bad. Could you please bail me out of this? Help. Help. I need a bail. I can click accept. Nothing's going to happen there. Can you, will you bail me out? That's a switcheroo yes. to Germany asking for France. For, I mean, they're the allies. They're the allies. They're in the true, right true. to call them. But, but Italy was allied with Russia. And then... Swapped again. Yeah. What is, what is happening there, France? What are you gonna do? Are you gonna pick a side? Oh wow, wow! Someone is probably on chat saying like top ten enemy betrayals or something. Uh, what are we waiting for? Are, are the Indians gonna jump on them too? Nah, so far they're just staying content no. of staying home. But they only have a royal marriage. Oh oh oh! Do we have a truce with uh, with Russia? Yes, they declined the call to arms. France, I say nope. Well, they, nope. they actually you make your bet. You make advice. your bet. You sleep in it. Sorry, Prussia. Oh my God! How many treaties and oaths have been broken today? This is like this is like open season on oaths. Yep. Please step in. <laughs> go ahead. Go ahead. Uh, we want explanation. Like this is like truth breaking one on oath breaking one on one. What yep. is happening? Introduce yourself, please. Uh, well, again, <laughs> again. Um, yeah, I'm the rep uh, representative for the Ruthenia. Okay, there um, we go. We've been we've been friend of Poland for a long time. We've been protecting them from Prussia. As you can see, we did the tentacle thing. Yep. Hug. A friendly hug. Yeah, a friendly hug. Poland had some lands in the I think it's like Mazovia region and Central Poland region. Yeah, I think this one. Yeah. Yes, yes, there yeah. was an agreement <coughs> to, to sell that land yeah. to so uh, Prussia. So we, we signed an agreement with Prussia that Poland uh, gives those provinces to them <coughs> and uh, Prussia signs uh, 50 years uh, no uh, aggression pact. Yeah, but are they gonna use uh, the pretext that technically they attacked you and not Poland? Uh, and so did that break the deal? Pretty sure it was. Sees all hostility and vice versa with Poland. I'm not a lawyer, right? But it does sound like <laughs> technically it does, did it, not attack you. But it does include three people. Uh, yes, we, but Rutania has not signed this, and their name is not no, on that deal. Uh, I mean, I'm not. I'm. I'm sorry. This is this. Uh, this Ooh, is the signature for Rutania. Big battle going on. Oh, wait, yes, yes. Oh, wow. How many people are there? Oh, wow. And Pro as you can Prussia see, Russia is Russia is trying to kill some Italians. As uh, you can it, see, Italians know who right and who is wrong. Ah. They joined on our side, just, even though no, they were no. allies. Oh, all, right, all right, all right, right. Let right, me so let me give you the, the, this. Italians are never on the side that has the right uh, from the start. They're always the backstabbers. <coughs> so do you, did but you find the representatives of the? Yeah, I think, oh, I think they said they don't care. They they, they they don't want to join. They they're what too should, busy. What can I do just do then? question then? Well, I get I guess she could send an ultimatum to Russia to tell like if you don't come is to defend your case, you're gonna be outbreaker and well, that's they, gonna be a done deal. They state that they didn't care, so yeah. I think you're in your own right right now. Well, I mean, can we get a Russian to come here and like, well, he, just, we, we asked. He said I don't want to come. I have a war to fight. I mean, there are three of them. Yes. <sighs> there are two, yeah. I think we, we, we need someone less biased to confirm this. Exactly. Sure. The but the monk yes, was there. I can go. I can okay. go and ask them again if they want to. I mean, to if you were sure, you would have... Okay, right. Sure. Yes. And we can Let's see Prussia's deal being destroyed on live. But first, we're going to see Prussian army being destroyed live because we have to do one thing at a time. 
So what is happening there? We have a lot of people on both sides. They picked the right battle though, because they try to pick a mountain. They have the shock on their advantage, but the other side of the fire, uh, the number or oh yeah, the number of the, the, the with the Germans though. Did someone else join the war? No, not yet. Uh, the, the conflict has not escalated more. Nope. Uh, so we try about chat. Okay, so we have instead oh. While Ritania fighting without a leader, this is not a good battle. They, they have something on their side. But, oh, now they have, and, and, and the Italian are being the firepower. They have, they have, the, they, they have the French ID for fuck's sake. They, they have discipline. They don't have the terrain, but they have the rest. Right, so we have, uh, we have the monks on both sides, and they're ready to reveal. Okay. What will all right. Happen. All right. Okay. So let's so, bring in the monks. Yeah. Let's watch the combat at the same time, because like, we have 300 k trying to solve the dispute in battle. But what is the church going to say about this? There is an oath, which was signed by Prussia, Poland and Ruthenia. And now uh, Ruthenia, representative, is accusing a Prussian a representative of uh, breaking an oath. What is uh, Prussia's response to that? Prussia will suggest to solve it by, by combat. Trial by Trial combat. combat it is! Trial yes. by combat! Trial by Ooh. combat! Well, I mean, they are doing it right now, but this one is going to be much more gentlemanly. It maybe did not involve a million dead this time. All Let's right. see how it goes out. Oh my god, those, those, those numbers, like the, the Prussian are getting slowder by the, by the, by the thousands. Not a good day to be Prussian. Not no, a good day to really. be Prussians. Sorry. And, and they are walking home. Like... All right. Thank they so are much. walking home. You are paying retribution for 1870. I'm not biased against Prussia at all. A lot of people walking around Saxony. They, 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 it's a bad day to be German. A yeah. very bad, bad day, day to, to be German. Prussian. I Ooh, think I no think the Swiss are the making the soft. right decision of fucking over to another continent, because yeah. Europe is not welcoming them anymore. Oh no! This is like a Jerkzit or something happening right now. Like everybody else is like, nope, Germans. This we're fed up with your shit. The, the HRE is, oh, wow, wow, look at this HRE, like, this is a joke of an empire. <laughs> yeah, they have, what, four France? electors. France is in the empire, yep. what are you doing, France? You surrender to the emperor. We have a trial by combat in minus 10 minutes. 10 minutes, 10 minutes, and the trial by combat is coming. Like, 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 usually the wars cannot get, like, to a point where one party Mughals can get, like, joined? 80%. Hey, Mughals have joined? Blue flames are on Mughals. <laughs> what are the Mughals doing? The Mughals have decided to join. Oh my god, this is dogpiling. They all all joining against the Germans. This, what I say, like, this is, this is like, you have to show strength. Mm -hmm. The minute you look quick, everybody's like, you know what, I'm gonna be on the winning side. Sorry, you're dead. Time to crush you. So but I don't know what the Mughals have to win by this. They're on the other side of the world. They're busy, like, Perhaps getting they're, back their They're men. in for shits and giggles, who knows? What is happening? Okay, so here we are, here we are. Oh, we have a lot of numbers coming in. Are they all gonna die somewhere in Poland? This is fitting. We are in Poland too. <laughs> this is a forest, the Persian on the attacking. No, the Mughals are leading the charge. The Mughals came all the way. Like, they have a score to settle with Prussia, it seems. Norway just joined. Norway is joining. The, like, we have 52 more German coming. That, is it gonna be enough? I'm not sure. I'm not sure the first line is crumbling, but they are still holding. We have a stack of 420k. Yeah, and if you look at the numbers, the the, the Prussian are actually dealing some damage, but but they need to do like double the damage to be able to, to ride. Oh, they got some reinforcement. That that gives them a kick in moral. But oh my God, how many people can they pour in one battle? Look yeah. at this, like like oh my God. Oh wait, wait, Norway is marching again. And that, a little 5k be, of Prussian yeah, coming yeah, in. Yeah, that's gonna be a relief, but that's not gonna be enough. But there's still the 61k of Italy to yeah, the south. Yeah, Italy is like, uh, Italy is like classic Italy. I'm gonna, just gonna sit here. Oh no, they're moving now. Like, uh, I don't think they need that. Look look at this battle. They don't... Oh, oh wait, wait. The Prussian are actually holding up. 
which they which is there. weird because like uh, do we have a better general four Ooh, four and Italy is coming three, five. in five yeah Italy is coming back because because the Persian are Persia, the, the Mughals are not getting a, like they choose the wrong side they got crossing no, 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 and no, 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 terrain no, no. minus two on every wall uh, even if their general is, is a that bit better on fire moving from from the south yeah the Mamluks are coming guys folks uh, Egypt Egypt is they walk all the way from India from all over the world to save no Prussia, no, we're not gonna do this today. We are fed up with your shit. Oh my god, this is a beating. Poor guys. I would say it's not entirely a tactical defeat. It's mostly a diplomatical defeat on the sense that if you appear to be on the losing side, people are gonna stay out. And if you happen to be seriously on the losing side, we have everybody's gonna come. What is, no, France is not as well. Someone lied to me. Oh, unconditional <laughs> surrender? Do we have unconditional surrender? Yes. Yes, Prussia just decided to give up. Like I'm done. This is this is the end. I'm I'm just getting out of here. It looks like Saxony is trying to relieve its provinces, maybe hoping that if they're not occupied, they cannot be demanded in the peace. Uh, like not having to pay for whatever. The, but but I don't think this is necessary. Like, Could they take the, this, these provinces? Okay, we're gonna move to the duel now. And peace in our time. The peace has been signed. What has happened? Oh, Saxony. What happened to Saxony you? Saxony paid for Prussian mistakes. Yes. Did it. Yes, I don't see I don't see anything changing on the Prussian side. They actually Prussia made a mistake and their allies paid the price. This is like the worst allies you can get. Hey. Hello Blondie, how's so, it going? It, it's going well. So as a turn of fate, uh, obviously since it's Prussia uh, involved in Oathbreak again, they have chosen the same champion as last time. Oh right. However, Ruthenia has called in a, uh, a champion which happens to also be the same champion that uh, the Swiss had. I wonder why. So we will see a rematch between the champions from the last uh, trial by combat. Did they? now? We'll it's see. a rematch for them. All right. Yeah, yeah. Tank by Prussia, and I believe... So it was a uh, draw at the same time? That's oh, a draw. Okay. Ooh, Ooh, that was a nice slam. That's a draw. Prussia trying to get in. Touched. Oh, there we go. One to one. This fight. <laughs> it is very tense in here right now. Everyone yep. is very Ooh. quiet. It's mm -hmm. two points for Prussia versus one for the champion of the you team. Need the And remember, unlike last time, Prussia does need to win this. Yes. Um, so right. this is a draw. If again. Prussia wins this, it's they done. will not be labeled an Oathbreaker. Ooh, yeah. oh. well done, well done. Three points for Prussia. Yeah. Oh. Right, so the other ones are coming, and if you didn't see, Prussia won on the duel. Okay. All right, we're back. We're back. It's, it's been a while, I guess. I think so, at least. Weeks, maybe. 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 I see some changes here. There are a few changes to the map. I'll need to investigate now because I've yeah. been uh, uploading cat pictures for the past <laughs> hour. So, <laughs> uh, I think we have a guest already to kick things off. Oh, they represent a lot of things that former Switzerland really held dear to them: integrity, freedom. Chocolate. Liberty, at least that's what I believe we're going to be hearing about. Maybe we need them down here. Are we getting someone down here? It's, uh, I think so. Oh, here we go. For the benefit of those at home, welcome. please tell us uh, who you are and what you stand for. We are Norway and its colonies, and oh, we are welcome. here to declare independence. The people of Nidnorga do believe the time has come to seek our own path, separate from the comforting embrace of the motherland. To this end, this treaty calls for Norway to immediately release Nidorga. 
Ninorga in turn will immediately form the United States of Norwegian America. In return for this magnanimous gesture, USNA will continue the main benefit of colonization for the motherland. Immediately after forming the USNA, the USNA agrees to transfer 50% trade power to Norway. While this deal is to last 50 years, the USNA commits to re-up this transfer at 10% less than the previous renewal in perpetuity. The USNA will also not declare war on existing Norwegian colonies and will encourage American nations to do likewise. This contract will remain valid regardless of any tag switching or name changing which may occur. <laughs> Signed, Nidnorga. And Norway. Let it be done. Well, congratulations. Excellent. God and save the empire. God save the empire. <laughs> that reminds me, Norway also has to announce that we will be switching to Scandinavia. Oh. It's a good thing we added that last clause. Huh? <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations all around. So, uh, <laughs> Great success for Norway and their uh, indeed their subjects there, and an interesting situation for Norway to be in, where they negotiate the independence of a nation underneath them. Uh, yep. I, feel, I feel like uh, should be going the other way around, but mm. no, works out well. So we'll be seeing New Norge become the USNA, I believe they're called, United States of Norwegian America. Uh, say a little more about the Inca, um, because they seem to have swallowed up a whole load of chocolate. Yeah. <laughs> well, I mean, Colombia remains with a single chocolatey heaven. Uh, oh, kind of wish this was called uh, chocolate heaven, but <laughs> not, not the case. Uh, and almost as if to celebrate this moment of intense freedom, where yes, we see Scandinavia on is. the map, and now the USNA. The, the border could be clearing up, but they said they would not be doing this through warfare. Uh, yes, yeah, so it's being celebrated by peace for our time. Yeah. It's almost like whenever we come down here, peace reigns. Yes, of course. I mean, pe people know that uh, they, they need to have love and not war exactly. in this landscape. Although we also know that it is bound not to last with the uni new United States formation. They get US ideas, which i got to say are pretty intense. Uh, I wonder if they get any claims or cores of their own. Well, I mean, they have claims down here in... Uh, this used to be Spanish last I remember, but now... What was the name of that? Avenge Britannia. <laughs> uh, but now they've renamed them now. Georgia here. <laughs> now we have SeaWorld. Universal <laughs> Studios. I love that. They, they heard me say I'm more of a Universal guy. Uh, we still have Disney World. We've got Legoland. <laughs> Please, Legoland is in Windsor. And a uh, golf course. <laughs> I love this. I, I love the fact that we got the names here in Florida. Switzerland still holds on in Dominica. It's still Swiss. Uh, no chocolate yet. Uh, no chocolate. But they are uh, they are subject to Australia. Strange things going on. Uh, <laughs> what I wonder is if Australia will uh, integrate, Swiss, uh, like bring Switzerland here, integrate them. And then perhaps release and play as them. I also just hope that they uh, they change. It. Oh yes, there we go. We are getting cultural enrichment <laughs> must, around here. Must be Swiss. <laughs> That's part of the deal, though, right? <laughs> we believe that all land must be Swiss. <laughs> uh, so we could claim that it's ours for eternity. And, you know, that's why no matter what foreign oppressors are in our mountains, they will always be populated by the Swiss. <laughs> Until they're not. So the Netherlands are dragged into a war. The war involves Great Britain. Great Britain is now defending against Scandinavia and against France. Poor Britain getting picked apart for having the gall to attack uh, Congo. And yet it's not the Congo that are consuming the lands. Okay, There's Mali. A got lot a bit. of stuff has been going on here. We had a few Mamluk promises and, and yeah. Like what, what do we have? Uh, what? what, what? Wick on the hull? What's I don't understand. On? What do we have? Raiding Britain, the province. <laughs> <laughs> I believe a deal was drawn up so the Mamluks would stop raiding. But uh, we'll see who who's even going to stop them if they try. France looking uh, mega powerful. 
especially since they have Brabant and Netherlands as their subjects, which only contributes to their strength, their force limit, their fighting prowess, and they remained allied with Spain and Italy. But uh, the Persian one is a bit strange. We were mentioning Italy just moments ago, and now a key representative for the Fritalians. Hello, is here. the Fritalians. I like that name. So, Welcome. to maybe the two people out there that don't know, who are you? Who do you represent, and what message do you bring? I am uh, I am Flory Wari. I am uh, playing as Italy, and uh, the message I bring is: we are Italy with French ideas. Right, Hi guys. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, we, you see, unfortunates who are failing to use God's creation, but they may someday dream of being French. <laughs> I'm a little confused, oh, which well, French? That, that is a bit confusing indeed. We might want to change the wording <laughs> on that. But no, a power play has been made, but your borders seem awfully stagnant here. In fact, I, I remember the corridor being here that's not here anymore. Yeah, that was a deal we made with the Saxons. So we sold the um, uh, eastern part of Hungary, and mm -hmm. we got the western part of it, like the coast, which Saxony controlled. They made a little tentacle to stop us. Oh. And then we... Uh, you could not be contained. Well, you could not be contained, so we made a deal. But uh, the, there hasn't been a lot of Italians versus Germans fighting. When is this well, going to change? Well, actually, it recently changed in the uh, Ruthenia War, and we took our rightful Italian suti roll. It does start out as Venetia, and they didn't culturally they enrich didn't it. They didn't culturally convert it, so we had a genuine mistake. reason. Yep. We, we want to invade the Germans very badly, because they left us out to dry in many a crusade. Uh, they just white peace out. It was their idea, they made the plan, we declared a crusade, and then they white peace out. And we lost Greece because of that, so... Especially when I was Switzerland, I was gearing up for the South and North War to happen. <laughs> we could watch the fireworks, maybe rent to both sides. We're not really there to see it anymore, but I want to feel it. You want to feel... well, there's gonna be... there's gonna be death and destruction. It was, um... You don't need to promise me. It's the many thousands out there watching oh. that want to hear the promises of death and destruction. Oh, there will so be death. So, let's speak directly to those watching right now. What do you promise the 4,124 people currently tuning in, you have their undivided that attention, number. make them ripe with anticipation? Germans are gonna die. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Out of context, you say. heard it here first. <laughs> <laughs> Out of context, just make a clip of that. <laughs> <laughs> we'll get something like uh, we'll get like long game short. Yeah, 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 yeah. And it, it just yeah. starts with Germans will die. <laughs> <laughs> yep. Germans are gonna die.